For this test, we're moving to the output of the inverter. We're going to look at the waveform shape and measure the amplitude and the phase angle. These are critical characteristics you need to know to understand the quality of the three-phase output signal. We'll begin by measuring the amplitude of each of the three phases, and then we'll measure the phase angle between two of the phases. We need to make sure that the output parameters are within the design tolerances. Let's set up the readings, starting with reading 1, measuring the amplitude voltage on phase A. Then we'll move to reading 2, measuring the voltage on phase B. and with reading 3, the voltage on phase C. For our final reading, reading 4, we're going to measure the phase angle between phases B and C. What you see on the screen now are the four measurements set up to measure key parameters. The voltage of phase A, B, and C, as well as the phase angle between phases B and C. With this one screen, you can look at both the quantitative metrics and the quantitative values of the three-phase signal. Plus, you can look at the shape and the quality of the actual three-phase signal checking for any anomalies or signs of distortion that may be causing problems on the output signal.